We're at Digital Experience with John Pizanski from Corning, who's going to be showing us today how the new Corning Gorilla Glass 2 holds up to the same stress, but at 20% less thickness. Yeah, so I'll talk to you today. We're going to show you a demonstration about Corning Gorilla Glass 2. 20% thinner thickness, same level of damage resistance and retained strength as current Corning Gorilla Glass. We have a demonstration here today. We're going to show you is here with this mechanical tester. Uh, pounds of force required to uh, test a piece of glass. And we're going to walk through a couple pieces of glass. We have non-strength and soda lime glass here. These samples have been sandblasted with silicon carbide, which is basically sandpaper particles, in order to, in, to put damage in the glass. They've all been uh, damaged the same or abraded the same. We're going to go ahead and break some of these soda lime samples to show you the difference in the load. This is non-strength and soda lime glass. It breaks around 46 pounds. So I came up with a glass that has equal performance to what Gorilla Glass has been, which is on all these models. This is strength in soda lime glass. So it's been through a chemical strengthening process similar to what Gorilla Glass would go through. You can go 20%. 61 pounds, a yeah. little less than the doubling of the strength. So you get a little bit of a benefit. So that's effectively Next, we're going to do a one millimeter piece of Corning Gorilla Glass. This is the current product leading in the market. Okay. And that's, that's, that's been really great. So we've already been. Go ahead and load this sample up. Uh huh. So we're up to 80 pounds, 90, 100, 112. 122. Still intact, but Corning Gorilla Glass 2 goes even further. 20% thinner. This is 0.8 millimeter thick. We're going to load this into the into the tester again. Existing Gorilla Glass is comparing. Going to load this sample up again. 20% thinner. 80. Okay. 100. Took that, he showed that it could be broken very easily. Yeah. And then he took the same 120, 122 pounds. He put it in there. 20% thinner. And it's a braided.